other women. So I'm, <laughs> so I'm presuming that because all these men, um, because all these men are not, they don't want to date modern day women. I'm presuming that you wouldn't have a problem dating a traditional woman. Um, a woman, I mean, a woman oh, with ho- traditional ho- values. Ho- 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 you know what I'm saying? I mean, that too. I am. I am. I am. I am. Um, so from Alice Dash Wayne dot com, her definition Wayne. of a traditional woman is um, strive to have that nuclear family, a husband, children, and uphold values that some people would see as old fashioned today. Um, traditional women understand. I'm putting it in present tense. Understand the value. Of a companion, husband, provider, a father, and not a baby daddy. <laughs> so. I mean, yeah. I mean. Yeah. Why are you making that face? Oh no, I'm. I'm I don't know. I mean, oh, okay. I mean, yeah. I mean, I mean, because because at the end of the day, and I'm not saying she got to be super traditional, like she can't work or nothing right. like that. If she want to work, she can work. But I, I I always felt like both people nowadays should be working if if you can if y'all can right. help it and right. you can have it that way if not right. then it is what it is i mean every it's situational everybody got you know their own thing going on right but you know because the whole thing about it is rather than wait until something happened at least both of y'all already be making bread together i'm mm-hmm. not gonna lie when i think of traditional women i think of amish <laughs> why? Why? I, don't oh, no. do that. I, I mean, don't know why? why? Because, because you <laughs> I don't, I right. just don't know. Right. A lot, of, and, and a lot of people <laughs> don't understand that tradition doesn't mean like you're a, you're a, 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 talking about a husband, a wife, or just in a relationship that the the woman is a slave yeah. to the man. Nah, that's I'm not what I'm tradition. Use word, no, I'm gonna use the word. I'm gonna use the word. I'm gonna use the word that most that most modern women will hate. That hate, and, and this is the reason why they a lot of them are still lonely and and where they don't want to be is because y'all don't submit, submit all caps to the person that you're trying to be with. Right. If you don't submit to the person that you with and that you're trying to be with, the male, the man, I'm not going to say the man that you're trying to be with, it's not going to work. But that man also has to give me a reason to submit Of to course. Him. Don't of just course. be like, oh, I'm going to yeah, submit to him. No, 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 no. You can't, right, as a right, man, right. you can't look for a woman to submit to you and or you ain't... Or a woman, ain't, you don't discriminate. Right. But still, you can't look for no man. Right. Not, this is a traditional woman. Yeah. Okay. We, so. th- you can't look for yeah. no man to, you can't look for no man that uh, a man can't look for a woman to submit and he ain't doing what he needs to do for her to submit. Right. Yeah. If I'm not no alpha, if I'm not no leader, if I'm not doing what I'm supposed to be doing. As a man. You know, as a man. Or the representation of a you man. You know what I'm saying? Then, or, then you know what I'm saying? It can't. It, it, she, how you going to expect her to submit? Right. Yeah. Because a lot of do, a lot of modern day men will be like that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I just want you to submit oh, because I make more money than you. Right. Like, no, oh, oh yeah. not even necessarily that. Try just, to have just control be, yeah. rather than yeah. oh, oh. be a, com- a, right. a, a, a equalized right. relationship. Or even just being a man, like you know, just being a male for that uh, for that matter. A lot of times, some uh, boys in men bodies um, uh, as a male. Had to have this this perce- this perspective or perception of just because I'm a man and I'm a male that you should give me some you know what I mean submit to me because I'm a man in this yeah, situation. And, and, but a lot of times yeah. your wife might be tougher than you. Yeah. Your man, your what your woman might like you said might be upholding more things than you as as a female. Right. So how like you said how can you like you said well, you got to give me a reason. As to why you and want then me a woman, a, a woman got to see that to oh he's oh. gonna be right. he's a leader he's gonna lead me and the kids right. and and stuff into our future and right. everything you know what I'm saying if you don't see that and if you don't see that and don't see that 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 right. God covering on that man right like, which you should see it naturally yeah you shouldn't naturally have to, like, it ain't you shouldn't so, have to yeah. be you have to you oh, have he, got, oh have he got the money yeah. and that. you, you shouldn't have the pull teeth to get yeah, him to yeah, do what yeah, he's yeah, supposed yeah. to do right basically. like I said and, and you, vice versa and his his lifestyle and not his his possession shouldn't be the thing that you be like oh he on his sh-. no no right. Cause no. that don't mean any. His right. possessions mean nothing. They right. could be taken away in a heartbeat. Exactly, right. and who so. is he once they're gone? This is just For like sure. a, a person that they uh, shoot everybody, but can he fight? I right. mean, but it's you not just saying? about possessions either. No, it's but about... a lot of the modern day women look at it like, oh, I mean, yeah. like, like if he got okay, he got okay, he, like, money, he got a car, he money. got a car, right? Yeah. Right. But he ain't got no Bentley. Right. He got a house, but he ain't got no, no mansion. mansion. Right. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's what I mean by possessions, but. Who is he as a person? You looking right. at through you trying to find his value through his possessions. Just like a dude shouldn't find value 
his value through his penis. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, oh, it depends on how many girls. I, I ain't that many girls, so I'm going to devalue myself because I ain't getting pussy like that. You right. know See, what I'm that, saying? And that's where a lot of... That's both, where a lot of nigga modern day men go wrong. Yeah, I'm right. about to say men and... Women, women too, though, cause women because women want the all they care body about count. They want the, the money. Now women want the body counts and stuff as well. And right. like I said, the money. They find like I ain't doing nothing if I ain't got no money. Right. Yeah. And like I said, that's not always the but case. See, but, that, right. but they also go wrong where even if the dude doesn't have that much money, they don't look at their values or anything underneath that. Like he he won't he won't have any money and he'll seem like a a, a good person or whatever. But right. then yeah, exactly. when they they not a good person no right. more. Yeah. Like I told and bro, people exactly. people men and women because yeah. a man will stick with a woman that's trash and a yeah. woman yeah. will stick with a man that's, that's trash. A traditional but be woman. Like, well, at least he could pay for right. you know this. At least right. he could take me out. Right. At least oh. she can uh cook. Right. At least she can like, wash my laundry. Like don't really. One of the biggest. That's cool and all, but right. you would rather suffer mm-hmm. right. every other way right. mm-hmm. than just go ahead and do what needs to be done. Right. Right. Like, one of the biggest things, one of the biggest things, like I was telling bro, like I was telling bro. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just cleaned it that was in throat. my way. <laughs> I was trying to like talk like this, and it once, was just in my once, way. <laughs> once, once again, one of the biggest things, like I was telling bro, that a lot of women don't want to do, um, and it goes, and it's, it's definitely vice versa. But I feel like more women don't want to do. Women don't want to build anymore. They want to just jump into a situation. Situation. They want to get basically or be comfortable. Hop, be, yeah, yeah. And that but that, but I'm saying, but that that's what I'm saying. They want to hop into a situation where the man already done got everything built, yep. and you just want to slide in and right. ain't got to do nothing. Nothing, mm. right? You but don't have to put no they don't know how to towards. build with somebody, right? Because they ain't even got their own shit built. Of course. You know what I'm saying? Because you live in, because and then and then, that, and then you and you talk about value. How can you value yourself when you living off somebody else's coattail? Right. You know what I'm saying? That ain't you. That's him. Right. So if he pick up and leave, he ain't marry you. He just pick up and leave. I mean, even if he what, who, you, you back? You back? Yeah, you back at square one. You back at square because one. even if you take some of his money, guess what he can go do? Yeah. He he he's a natural born leader. He can go right. and create something else and make even make even more money. And he, guess what? You ain't in his life no more. Right. What you gonna do? Right. You you don't know how to do anything. Well, more than likely she gonna try to find, find the another money nigga. Out, and that's it. And now she and now that she got continues. the money, now she got the money. When she starts seeing the money, now she can be around the ballers and everything because she got the money to be yep. in those places. She got right. the access because she got the money to be in those yep. places. Now she gotta try to outbid these other bitches. Yeah. Though. Now what can you offer? Right. What can you offer? What can you offer another? That she can't offer. Y'all both got vaginas, right. and that's what more more than likely those men are just. Mine is be made after. of gold. Right. Yeah, well, and that's yeah. what they think. That's made of gold. Like, look, vagina is fine, but they come a dime a dozen. Let's right. come on. Let's be right. honest. I will also say though, not saying that, all vaginas are the same, but no. still, like, I will yeah. Also, I will, <laughs> no. Not saying that because you know sometimes no. people can get that misconstrued. No. I will also say and, though, and, and that's how niggas get caught up. Yeah, that's <laughs> some so. dudes are trifling too though, because just like oh, with yeah. the whole situation that's going on, with DJ Mustard and his ex. Oh, I don't know nothing about that. When they basically were in the dirt together, and she was there when he didn't have no money, and then he got money, and now he cheated on her and left her and. She out back because she put signed a prenup, right? Ain't giving her nothing, right? Like that's and they got kids, yeah. That's, well, if that's not well, she, she was good. Well, I, I mean, I, I mean, that's not fully a blame on him, only because of the fact that she signed a prenup. If if somebody from being, I from mean, the which is which is true, coming up with you, like, but what I'm but saying should, is, that shouldn't even be a question of a. That should be that shouldn't even be a question of a prenup. She thought in a that they like were probably gonna true. be together forever since they started from the bottom and they got to the which top together. Which is also together. true, which and 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 some people, prenup? I mean, but, but I some people, that's why she's there. Are people who are together to the, there are people together to this day that have signed a prenup and they're fine with it. Whatever works for you works for you. And like Kiki said, that's probably how she thought. Even though she signed a prenup, that if something were to happen. Well, they would be together forever for one, but if something were to happen, regardless if they signed a prenup or not, he would still be the kind of person that she thought he was and still take care of her and the kids if they weren't going to be together. Okay, you don't even have to I mean, take care of her. To, he's supposed take to, care to, take care of the kids. Yeah, right. Kids, if he though. ain't taking care of the kids, then he a, that's crazy. Then he a chump, like, man, yeah, yeah, you know what yeah, I'm that's saying? Some, that's some chump shit. But, you know, necessarily, I mean, respectfully... I mean, he no, that's his money. No, he ain't. I mean, no, but that's but that. But what's that gonna make you look like to your kids that you're not taking care of the mother of your? That's not my job. I'm not saying it's not. I'm not saying it's his job. Uh-huh. Y'all, y'all. I didn't say that right, was right, his right. job. But, you but what right, I'm saying, if she's not working and not has no sort of income, yeah. 
Y'all get a divorce. Uh-huh. Where is she gonna go? I'm not gonna have. Okay, okay, okay. Time out, time out, time out, time out, time out, time out. You right, you right, you right. Hold on. I would not have. I would not have. This is just me personally. Depending on why we divorce the situation. If, if, if well, it, he cheated, it, so. Oh well, damn. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> so they got they getting a divorce because of that. He cheated. Okay, I would not because because of my children. Thinking of my children. All right. I would not have my children's mother basically asked out, you know, so to speak. Now, you ain't, I don't got to give you no millions right. of dollars. I ain't got to right. give you, you, you to be on your feet. Right, right, right. For you to be on your feet. Okay, but I'm just saying, I'm just saying for, yeah. for you. Like 10K or something? Or something no, like it's that. like 80. They got how many kids? Like three or four? Yeah. Three, yeah. So, so 80K like, is, yeah. is, is, is a want, reasonable about yeah. compared to how much but you make. How, how, how often do I got to pay that 80K though? A month. Almost. 80,000. As much as he gets based off his income, that is nothing compared to all. I don't know about I mean, I don't know. 80,000 80, add up. I said based money. off his income, though. Well, I don't. Okay, okay. But based off my income, which means that if my income changed, that means then, your then, shit being right. changed. If, if right. your income changed, yeah, that's right. how it works. If, 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 if your okay, income okay, changes, okay, then so they decrease or that, increase said, the thing. With yeah. that being said, then, with that being said, like I said, me personally, I want to see the, the my children. Cause it, it, one, Especially because of my children. Yeah, because that, that's what I can't have them. Like, if your lights is out. Yeah. I mean, I the whole thing about it, I ain't got my children going over there. But right. you still their mother and they want to see you. And right. of course, I'm, if your lights is out, now I will help. But don't. Take advantage of that shit. Like, right. you know, oh, he paid my light bill last time. He'll pay this. Time. No, because yeah. you need, I can help you out on your feet, but it's up to you as the mother of our children yeah, to, do what, right. to, to be do what needs to yeah, be done on your that. part now because we're not together yeah, anymore. Right. Which, which I agree with that wholeheartedly, too. I just said that the, the situation they're in right now is ugly because it because he dirty. I don't like it. From outside looking in, I mean, it's yeah. dirty. But at the end of the day, regardless, some people do stuff like that, and that's some the reality of it. Uh, so it's like, like I said, even like he might don't even care that his kids look at him and view him that way. Yeah. Because as that's long terrible. as he's doing personally for his kids and his kids see that, they might look at him as the best person in the world and say, "Hey, well, mom is the one that's struggling, but dad doing good." So you understand what I'm saying? So that and he, and they doing he doing good enough for them because realistically, regardless of their children or not. They are still individual human beings, and they are going to eventually have their own life once they grow up or become, you know, adults, quote, quote unquote. So once that situation happens, you know, he can stop taking care of the kid. Like I said, once the kid turned 18, now the kid taking care of himself anyway. So, you know, the dad can say, fuck it, I ain't, taking, I ain't going to spend no more money on the kids now. Now the kids can really view their father as like, oh, he's not a great person because he's not doing for us anymore. You understand what I'm saying? Beats where... It was, you know, they were, okay, they weren't doing it for moms, but, I mean, moms ain't me. I'm, I, dad's still doing it for me. So, especially in this day and time, that's how it can be looked at. Like, you know that's what I mean? It's trash. So, yeah, oh, I, 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 feel, yeah. I feel what you're saying, but I'm just saying, that's like, that's how, fault. that's the, the reality of it. the kids even end up thinking like that, that's on the parents. Yeah. See, that's, you know, that's the parents. thing I always yeah. say. I was not want to, like, if my relationship didn't work out, I didn't want it to be like, Please don't talk bad about your your, your significant other. Yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> to the kids, because yeah. then they they listen. Oh, they yeah. fi- they'll figure it out on right. their own. Kids are and, smart. And, yeah, and then too, eventually that too, because they even like for example, say for for example, I'm gonna just get a little personal. Like my situation with my moms, like my mom used to always like say like my dad was stingy and like say like stuff like yeah my dad wouldn't do or he would only do half ass shit or whatever the case may be. But then as I got older and I started realizing certain situations, especially when it came to jobs with my own mother, like she, you know, she would I found out she would lie to me about certain stuff and make it seem like this happened. Like say she would got say she would got fired from a she say she got fired, but the whole time really realistically she would quit and she would tell my grandmother that she quit the job and because she, you know, because she saw that her son was working two jobs and she was like, Oh, well, my son working two jobs, I ain't gotta work nowhere. You understand what I'm saying? So, and then, then when I see that, and I'm like, well, dang, like, well, truthfully, how was my father really with you? Was he really paying to help you pay the bills? And then just because he didn't do something for you that one day or how you wanted it now, all of a sudden you talking bad about him and saying this, that, and the third. So, you know, I see a lot, so, and a lot of times stuff like that can happen. Like, and you, like you said, especially when a child becomes older and they find out on their own, they figure out, like, well, mom said dad won't did that in the third, but. Mom's still having a hard time finding a good man. She, if she's such a good person, why she can't find nobody? Hold on, it don't it don't make it ain't make it ain't adding up, you know? Or why she can't? You know what I mean? So I won't particularly say that, but that could be. That but could I'm play saying a part. like I've, yeah, it plays a part because I, I see it with my own mother, or yeah. like even with relationships. She'll say somebody this, that, and the third ain't doing something, but 
still messing with that person, you know, or her, her, her quote unquote. Oh, that, that, whatever, that's like that, that. That's what people yeah. do in general. Yeah. They'll 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 <laughs> go back and forth. Yeah, but but, but like even I said, with that, like like you said, if you stand on something, like you stand, you should stand. Oh yeah, there. like definitely. you shouldn't be like, oh, well, Vindicate. this person ain't ish, and then next thing you know, you laying up in the bed. And, and that's you know what, what people. And, and, and the reason and, why people and, do and that. Like, yeah, and the reason why. And the reason why people do that is, like I said, they comfortable. Yeah. They don't want to, they either comfortable or unfortunately they scared to, to change because yeah. they don't want to be by themselves. Yeah. They don't want to have to yep. deal, they don't want to have to start over. Yep. But instead of, and, that, and that's why I tell, like, when, when Jamal and I, when Akeem and I be talking about certain stuff like that, it gets to a point, and not with everybody, but it's just like, what's the point of complaining if you're not going to change the situation? Facts. Big facts. If it's the facts. same thing. Over and over again. Why no, did you I, turn that way? I don't know. I, I was wondering, too. I was kind of like, at the scratch. I think she got the I scratch. I did have oh, the okay. scratch. Oh, okay. oh, I was about to say. <laughs> but if, 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 like, if you want a scenario to change, mm-hmm. regardless of a relationship, a job, or whatever, mm-hmm. If you, I just feel like, and this is just my opinion, mm-hmm. I feel like you can't keep complaining about it if you're not going to do anything about facts. it. Facts. I mean, Especially yeah, if facts. you can do that's something amazing. about your facts. situation facts. and you just choose not to. And you choose not to. You can't, like, keep, you can't, you can't keep complaining, complaining about, about it. Come like, on. I, I definitely don't want to hear keep, that shit. Because what? <laughs> that, it, that's, isn't that where, what people say that will drive you insane? insane yeah. Like, that's where insanity comes yeah. from into play because you keep doing the same sh- over and over again and, and think that something's going to change. And it's not, it's not going to change. It's not going to change. And I tell... And then people looking at me like and she's then, about to knock me out. But but the, but I tell people in general that I, the whether they talk to me or I talk to them because I've had people tell me that too when it came to certain things Jamal and I were going through. But the stuff that Jamal and I were going through, did I ever feel like that it wasn't going to or that it was going to change? Sure, of course I did. But I'm pretty sure Jamal has felt the same way when it when it came to our our relationship and marriage. I'm right. pretty sure it felt the same. Nigga, I'm shocked you still here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm shocked. I'm still here. But the thing, but the thing that I can say that <laughs> the thing that I can say that Jamal and I always, I'm not gonna say always, but most of the time we still ended up doing was talking to each other. Yeah. Did our communication suck at a certain point? Yes, but it. Heifer. It, <laughs> I know, right? It's her fault. But it it got to the point where. We both were like, we just both set our own boundaries. Like, well, look, if you can't do this, then we we just over. Like, yeah. we we not gonna try to For keep sure. continuing something. For sure. But we let each other know what we both want, what we both expect out of each other. Sure. And if one can't do that, or we both can't do it, then yeah. we're both to come to agreement and be like, we didn't it. Right. Then. For sure. And people don't want to do that because, like I said, either they comfortable yeah. or they are scared of change. And, and and of course, that has crossed both of our minds of starting over because you don't want to start over, and then too, but it's not worth. Yeah. Like, and it's then not. too, some people. Games, once again, like you said, a lot of people, like you said, they, they use people as backup plans. They oh, use yeah. like a, a plan a they don't work. Until something plan better B. comes oh, along. Right, right, but, um, right, yeah, right, of course, that, they definitely do that. that. that too, yeah. Then some people go for bad. Some people want to go for the oh yeah, I might hate this at the moment. The whole time they like fighting their they, they counterpart. They like you know uh, going through the book like getting And I will say modern day women do that too. Yeah, modern day Yeah, it's, like, it's, it. blue face. Yeah, it's, it's a lot of people that go for bad and they like yeah. Exactly. You know what I mean? Like, he, dude just said, she, this girl done slept with 10 people in the last month, couple but months. But they supposed to be on. Yeah. You, you see what I'm saying? So but, that's, like, but that's what I'm saying. Modern yeah. day women will do that. Because like yeah. I said, they comfortable. Yeah. And the, the, the dude will do that too. Yeah. Comfortable. Comfortable. They, they like what they yeah. used to. Yeah. But as soon as something better comes along, they're like, oh, I'm done with that person. Well, and so out of that person next. The thing with the, the girl is because the girl came from absolutely nothing until she met him. Yeah. So now she, she like you said, she's comfortable. Right. It's the lifestyle she knows right. now. She's, she don't, he's a famous, he's a celebrity, yeah. he's making... I won't call him a nigga all that. But, right. um... So, but, 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 <laughs> but it's a different yeah. lifestyle, yeah. It's a different lifestyle right. than what she used to. Yeah, because right. she, 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 her, her family she, used to live in her car, but now it's like the people that you struggle with, you left them behind. Right. Just for this one guy. Right. And I would never understand that. Like, right. If I'm struggling with somebody, if I have no real reason, I'm not leaving you behind. Right. Unless you want to stay in that situation. Right. That's it. Which, is, like you said, sometimes I that mean... happens. And not saying that didn't happen in that situation, because it might have been personal stuff. Because, I mean, of course, you see the little show where they show it is her dad and her brother and all that, and he trying to fight the blue face. And yep. dad trying to... Like, it's all this type of stuff that can happen. 
literally that can cause a person to not want to do that and want to help their family sometimes. <laughs> but, you know, at the same time, like you said, if y'all if y'all came up in a struggle, you and your family came up in a struggle, and y'all trying y'all best to be in a in a more successful or like like I said, in a more financial better state than what you're in. But and then when you like you say you find an opportunity and it might just so happen to be a situation like hers with dealing dealing with this guy that's making millions of dollars or whatever the case may be, and she look at it like, well, this can help me, you know, help support my family, then yeah. But like you said, a lot of times, depending on the person, what they going through at that time, because, you know, I'm pretty sure a blue face look at it like, well, he probably like, well, I already know what you're here for, so I already know you're trying to, or once he found out about her life and what's going on in her life, that's why he probably was like, well, look, I sign you as an artist. But then next thing you know, now he's starting, they starting to hunch. They well, starting I, to have sex and stuff. Now they, you know what I mean? And all oh, these things is going on. So I will like, say this, and then, then we got to, then we got to, we going to cut him. Yeah. What Shakira just said, yes, that's what people will also do. If they come from nothing, then whoever they are with at the time or whatever, they won't even, they'll just cut out those people that they came up nothing with. Yeah. But you also have people who, even if they don't come from anything, if mm -hmm. they, if, even if they came from something, as soon as they find, they feel like there's a better situation or whatever the case may be, mm -hmm. they will allow the person that they with to do stuff and give them a pass over and over again. Yeah. But then when it comes to their family, their family do something, they don't want to have nothing to do with them anymore. Yeah. I don't get that. Yeah. Like, you can't be mad that, you know, you have people that do that but, I mean, you have people that also, like I said, once they get the better situation with whoever they're with, they don't want to have nothing to do with their family anymore. Yeah. But let that person that they with do the same thing that somebody in their family did. Yeah. They won't, they'll cut that family member off before they do, yeah, they, before they course. cut the person that of they're course. with off because they like the person they with of for course. whatever for reason reasons, right. better than they do their family. Right. I course. think that's weird also. Yeah, of course. And I think that's also disrespectful because that's... Yeah, that's whoever you're with. Yeah. That's your family, too, at the end of the day. If you could give the person that you're with that's not even guaranteed a pass right. for doing the stuff that you said you would never forgive your family for, you should be able to do the same thing with your family and forgive them for whatever they did, too. Right. You can't be one-sided. Like, I but think that's weird. But sometimes, like you said, some, but sometimes, like, when it's your family and it's, like, blood-related, it's, like, it's, it's more close. Sometimes it can be more closer to home in a more uh, a mental state than anything because it's, like, Damn, my family did this to me. Beat Which somebody is, out in the streets. Like, like you, you, you kind of expect somebody out in the streets to do it more so than your family. I mean, but so you understand and out saying? in the streets, yeah. So, but yeah. even as your significant other, you wouldn't expect them to do certain of stuff too. You if, that's right, other. if that's your significant other, if that's your significant other, if that's your significant other, you like can't. Like I said, that's the problem though. A lot of times, people view their significant other in different ways too. So, for example, like some people can view their boyfriend as their husband. And he, he doesn't even do husband duties or he doesn't uh, upheld a husband position. But it's like, oh, that's my husband or that's my hubby or that's 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 my one and only type shit. Right? That's kind of like with my coworker, like the girl Coco I was telling you about. I, like, yeah, I don't care. No names. Yeah, she ain't going to see this. Anyway. No names. She ain't, she ain't going to see this. So it's Name good. bomb. But and if she do, she know. She already know what time it is because I've told her about this into her face. So, like I said, Slut. she'll be all this about... I'm loyal to my boyfriend. This is my man. This is my on and only. But I've witnessed her multiple times, including other coworkers that have witnessed her. Talk to men, give her number to men, give her uh, Instagram information to men, even entertain another man in a sense of conversating with this man to that extent where if it was her boyfriend had walked in those doors while she was doing that, it'd be, it, it, she would be like, oh, I'm just helping him out with the whole time. you having a whole conversation with this man about nothing about this in the store, about what fit he's looking at or none of that. You want to see what's up with him, he wants to see what's up with you. Slut. And then now you done exchanged the information. But at the same time, once again, you talking about, on the other hand, when I talk and I talk some real shit to you, then you saying, oh, yeah, I would never do that to my boyfriend. Oh, I love my my, my boyfriend. That's a, that's who I want to marry. That's You want to marry him, but you just gave this dude your number. You just gave this dude a follow on Instagram, and y'all follow each other and communicating. A heathen. <laughs> heifer. A heathen. And then flirting with heathen me. Is heifer. Like, this ain't even just about just, like, the, the, the other, like, just even with me. Like, I'm like, you saying all this, but... If I tell you something about, I say, oh, oh, this hair, this hair color look nice on you or something, or like it look nice on you. Or she, next thing you know, she like, oh, I want to get my hair dyed red. I'm like, well, I just told you that the other day, or I said, or oh, what? I'm just, I'm just. But me, I'm a single man. I can do that. 
and say stuff or whatever or whatever. She's an attention I don't even, seeker, apparently. I, exact, exactly. Definitely an attention seeker. But that, like I said, that leads into other things. When you that much of an attention seeker, and then, like you say, you have a significant other shit, that should be the only person you really giving attention to or getting seeking now, attention from. Now, I don't know what's going uh, you know, on in their home, but maybe she feel like she ain't getting enough attention from him. But maybe. then again, that's when the communication comes from. Like, talk about this. If right. you ain't getting enough, let him know. Right. Could okay. be. Or he is giving her enough attention, and she feel like it's Agreed. too much attention. And she feel like, or, or attention from him, she don't really want it. She want, like you said, attention from the circus. She want to figure out who else going to give her well, attention. well, she want that. She so, leave this man alone, let him go on with his life. So but okay. In, so end note would be basically modern modern women get your stuff together. Yeah. Um everybody uh, uh, uh y'all y'all you can say that you don't need a man or whatever, but uh, potentially or eventually you you might come across one. You're gonna come across one that you really uh, that you really end up loving and wanting to be with. Let your guard down. Don't be so headstrong or hard headed just because you feel like you don't need a man. Exactly. <laughs> but also modern day men, because y'all are not left out either. Don't um feel don't think with your peen peen, as Jamal said <laughs> earlier. Uh, it shouldn't be don't, about don't value yourself uh, right Okay, don't, don't value like, yourself with your with yeah, your but, part. But, but that too, but don't think right. with your PPE. Don't right. think that the only way you become a man is by having sex with multiple women. Right. Yeah. So, yes, thank you for tuning in. The baby's hungry. Salt and vinegar chips. <laughs> so, uh, y'all have a blessed so night. Peace. <laughs>